<coughs> okay. <coughs> Palpak yung internet kanina mga kuya. Nireset ko pa yung router ko. And let's see. Okay. What's up, Jan R? Jan R. All right, that's not the bit rate no content. Let's do three thousand. Okay, three thousand Mbps. I mean kbps. Ah, dang. <laughs> but now, my too big pa dito from yesterday. Oh God. <clears throat> mm. Hmm. So is the the original uh, stream link still working? I reset ko pa yung router ko, boys. It bagal ng upload. Sometimes talaga nagkahagan eh. <laughs> But now may too big pa. Okay. Oh boy. Oh boy. Let's do. Wait, na kuwan nyo na yung chat. That's good. Isa pa tayong siray. Ayusin ko ba? Bago tayo mag-start. <laughs> yung ating song, yung current song playing is uh, is broken because of a Spotify update. Now it's broken. Buka ko ayusin. By quote-unquote uninstalling and reinstalling a new version. Kasi nagka-crash yung new version eh. My theory here is... Kailangan fresh install. So we'll do that. doesn't work. Wow. So wala tayong, wala tayong current song. <laughs> Wonderful. Okay. Don't care at all. <clears throat> A 
Let's look at these Android P stuff before we start, huh? I'm gonna link that and everything, right? We're streaming correctly, properly. You yep. don't. Okay. Let's do 1080p. There we go. <clears throat> Let's make this uh, webcam flipped over. Actually, do we need it flipped over? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, that might work. Webcam flipped horizontally. There we go. Magnot. Seems better this way. Okay. Um. <coughs> all new notification panel, new settings, official notch support, and a ton of other tiny changes. Material design too. Rounded rectangulars or rectangles are everywhere. <coughs> oh, ah, rounded rectangles. Yeah. Means that talaga yung yung mga ganitong changes. Sometimes it's just it's just so that there are some visual changes from different versions. Yeah. Pagkain na naman ang ipapangalan sa bagong Android. Of course, hindi <laughs> lagi naman pagkain. No? It's always food. They always uh, name it with food. <clears throat> Which makes it weird kasi yung Android O, yung, um, how do you call this? Yung Easter egg niya is an octopus, which is super weird. Hindi siya Android Oreo. Siguro, they didn't get the, um, <clears throat> the official naming trademark allow allowed. Android Potato? Hindi, Android Puto Bongbong. Android puto bumbong. <laughs> Android puto. <laughs> oh god. Blah. This is yesterday's water. <laughs> Wala ko maha... Ano yun? Hindi, pupunta pa ako sa baba para sa tubig. Uh, ano yun? Multitask? No. Hindi, menus niya. Nag-iba yung dating, ano? Yung animations. Hmm. Notifications expand to fill the screen. Oh, I like that. That looks nice. Tatanggalin na lang natin yung current song kasi hindi na gumagana yung current song natin. Or, yeah, hindi. Natatandaan yung dating BTS na, ano? <laughs> Ganun na lang gagawin ko. <laughs> Wait lang. Gawin natin yun. Uh, old school BTS current song. Yeah. And then... Yeah. Wait. Paano ba yun? <laughs> Uh, kailangan talaga i-type mo. Bad trip yun, ha? <clears throat> yun. Ay. Ay. Wait lang. Kailangan natin baguhin yung size. Ba't ka noon? Hindi ko maggalaw. Oh, hindi siya gumagana ng maayos. Sa Spotify. Lol. Wait, refresh natin. And then select region. Hindi siya magana ng maayos. Hindi ko pwedeng baguhin. Seryoso? Ah. 200. Okay. Tapos. Eh, yun naman siya. Ayaw lang gumalaw. What the heck? Tignan nyo. What? What? Ah, ambuy, nakakaasar talaga tong bagong Spotify na to. Nakakaasar sobra. Kabubon. Tingnan. 
Tingnan, tingnan nyo naman. Tingnan nyo yung bago Spotify. Nasaan yung button sa taas? Sige nga. Sabihin nyo sa akin. Ha? Sino nag-program nito? Oh. Sa bogi. Eh. Asan yung minimize? Oh. Sino gumawa nito? Sino matalino gumawa nito? Oh, pa- ba't hindi umaandar 'yan? Ba't hindi umaandar yung mga button? Ha? Kasi tanga sila. Hindi mo under yung button. Oh, sige. Alam mo kung bakit? <laughs> What's up Kuya MP Simon? Jim Carlsarezo and Kuya Senin. I think sa bugito dahil naka-laptop ako and then naka-external monitor ako. Doon sa internal monitor ng laptop, nakikita ko siya. Pag wala pag nasa external monitor, sa bug siya. So that means it's using both the internal GPU and external GPU something like that. Something stupid like that. Alam niyo naman yung mga dual GPU ng laptop, minsan nagtit nagaano siya. Nagse-switching siya. Now, that's why sa bugitong sa bugitong graphics ni Spotify. Ah. Uh, <clears throat> What's up Korea Carlo Azores? Nakagising ko lang. Nagising ako mga 9-10. <laughs> Sinundo kasi namin yung mother ko sa ano. My mother went on a ferry cruise pabuntang uh, Japan. Na- Naha Japan and Taiwan. Ano yung kailangan akong tanggalin dito? What's the... Skype ngayon. Tanggalin natin si Skype. <clears throat> Alright, that's working fine. Break tax is start, starting soon, Muna. Alright, so ang topics natin for today. Um, if you haven't seen it, sa ating uh, graphics, no. Uh, we got a bunch of phones. It's not. It's not been the uh, the craziest week ever, but there are phones. There are announcements. Um, and there are more games on the like uh, Asphalt Nine. Actually, I want to see that. Let's start the show. <coughs> At least manood tayo ng mga YouTube. <laughs> Let's watch some YouTube stuff. Alright. <coughs> Let's pause this music. Basurang Spotify player na ngayon. <coughs> hey, what's up guys? Alex here from TechnoClass.com and you're watching The Big Time Show. It is Saturday. March 10th. 2018. It's um, it's a week past our uh, MWC recap show. Again, most on electric fan, and uh, there are some stuff going on. <clears throat> um, obviously, tapos na yung uh, big big announcements like the the Zenfone 5, the notch gate, and the oh, dami nang magiging notches ngayon for now from now on. <clears throat> The notch gate. Oh, may no comments sa ating ano. Wait lang, basahin natin. Oh, mangyari. Masarap yung Android puto bumbong. <laughs> Sabi sa inyo, Android puto eh. And then, let's do this scene. There we go. Um, let's look for... Yeah, so... <laughs> ang topic sa atin for today include... Uh, Oppo A71 just been announced. Uh, Huawei Nova 2 Lite Although Tinitis na yun for a while now uh, Asphalt 9 Legends Nintendo stuff And then Android Puto Bombong What's up ate Nyao Nyao? <coughs> Hanap tayo ng Asphalt 9 video Pero naman, magiging, magiging bagong kalokohan na naman to eh Si Asphalt 9 eh Asphalt 9 Hindi na ako maglalaro ng ganito. Nasaan yung ano? Hanap tayo Gameloft channel. 
Ayoko ng mga in- unofficial video. Yun. <coughs> Alright, let's see. Ba't walang asphalt? Nine. <laughs> Wait, ano ba to kalokon ba to wala silang video ng Asphalt 9? Okay, tingnan tayo. Tingin tayo sa Play Store. Asphalt 9. Eh wala naman ni. Eh. Wait, ah wala pa ba sa Android? <laughs> oh, wala pa sa Android. Ano na ba? Ano namang meron? Wala pa ba? Asphalt 9. Okay. Official soft launch preview. Oh, mi channel si Asphalt. <coughs> Grabe na naman siguro mga marketing efforts ni Huawei for Nova 2. Nova 2 Lite eh. Hindi naman 2i ata eh, right? It still looks the goddamn same. What the? F- ano pinagbago? <laughs> this looks promising and better than Asphalt 8 because Extreme was boring. But this is another serious racing game. What? You? You taking a piss? Um, wala pa rin siya sa Android, I think. Let's see. Um, join the Facebook page. Alright. Yeah, let's see. Ano oh, meron dito? Uh. Mm, soft launch pala, I guess. Wala pa rin sa Android, I guess. Ang problema ko sa Asphalt is, ano eh, I mean sa Game Loft themselves, they're so, they're pretty much kind of a scumbag company. Um, I mean, hindi yung ano, hindi yung, hindi yung scumbag like EA. <laughs> but like a, a scumbag pa rin. There's a little bit of scumbag pa rin sa, sa Game Loft. Um, for, for, yung, for Asphalt 8, they promised no microtransactions. And then one-time payment only, one-time buy, buy buying of the game only. Same as Modern Combat 5. I bought both Asphalt 8 and Modern Combat 5 in the expectation na one-time lang ako bibili ng ng mag, walang microtransaction, walang loot box, walang uh, bullshit boosts or walang ganon. And then mga one month later after binili ko sila, each both the Asphalt 8 and Modern Combat 5. They went free to play, and then obviously, lahat ng bumabili, binigyan nila ng konting mga freebies and shit. But my problem is, I don't want these free to play shit games. I don't want a game that is incomplete or something that I feel like. Merong lagging, nagging shit that will say, oh, guy, maybe you should buy a boost today. Right? I don't like that. Um, I don't play games. That are purposely built to nag you about boosts or or ano. I know some people uh, obviously walang pera or walang pambile. Okay lang sa kanila yung mga free to play, especially since hindi naman ganon ka kabigat sa kanila yung yung hindi naman ganon ka ka hindi sila ganon ka hardcore or ganon whatever. And gusto lang nila maglaro ng game every now and then. But sa totoo lang, most people pay more money for free-to-play games than they do 
on 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 non free to play games so if you if you get what i'm saying here is most people will eventually pay money to buy some some shit dito sa game na to if it's free to play and ako gusto ko, i just want to put out I, I just just ask five dollars from me right now and give me the whole game don't give me all this bullshit oh hey you paid five dollars and now now we're gonna promote boosts boosts boost and crap like that and whatever I don't want a game like that I want a solid standalone game from start to finish without without the microtransactions but unfortunately gonna see ganun yung ano, ganun yung ngayon, eh, because people are microtransaction holes and and it's it's so irresistible for for brands like this game loft and whatnot to go free to play so you know problem audito it's it's the free to play um, it doesn't look like it's uh, it's going to be paid app for uh, for the early part of the game but I'm still I've still lost a lot of respect for for game loft for 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 basically going back on their word literally they they said ayan basahin ang ganap tayo ha asphalt 8 not free uh, uh um no micro uh, tingnan natin kung meron tayong mahanap na information ano um let's see Let's see. Let's uh, look for Modern Combat Five um, one-time purchase. You know, uh, yeah, yeah. I think I'm not that. Wala na, wala na information. That's what I'm saying. Hinanap ko to. Maramay ako ni research sa ganito about this, these both these games. Um, no microtransactions. Tignan natin. Alam ko inannounce nato eh. Um, Oh, here we go. Here we go. Ah, uh, I don't know what happened here. Ah, this was a 2014 article. Modern Combat 5 will not have in-app purchases. Hmm. They confirmed a bunch of new details. The biggest of which is that it will not have. It will not contain any in-app purchases. Um. In Modern Combat 5, all of the unlockable items and the character leveling will have to be done simply by playing. That does not... That's not... That's not the fact... Uh, what, what is currently fact right now. Because it is free to play and you pay for every for a lot of boosts and what, uh, whatnot. So they lied, right? Modern Combat 5 straight out lied. Alright, Asphalt 8. Uh -huh. <clears throat> Let's see. Nabi natin. Um, I guess it all. No, I don't know. <clears throat> I don't know why this game lost. Oh, okay, that's not it. Mm, I guess ito now free. Hanap tayo. Hanapin natin yung information. Oh yeah, I'm using an ad blocker. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Microsoft shit. Fucking Windows fuck. <clears throat> I know free to play na ba to? Baka free to play na yung pinag-uusapan niya. Yeah. Look at all this shit. Look at all these microtransaction shit. That does they promised none of this shit when Android 8 came out when Asphalt 8 came out. They promised none of this shit. But now everything is microtransaction. The only reason why I wanted to play What's up Farmer Sanchez? The only reason why I wanted to play Asphalt 8 and Modern Combat 5 is only, only if there were no microtransaction shit. And then instantly, one month later, they make it microtransaction shit. I am no longer going to play any Game Loft games. I I love Game Loft. I love what they did with the mobile space, but it, uh, 
their previous games were great. Yung mga uh, Modern Combat 4, 3, 2 in 1, they were single player full like Call of Duty style games that you pay for like I don't know, I forgot kung mga, mga $4, $3. You play play the campaign and then maybe play online. That's it. There were no microtransactions that day. But now, yeah, shit. I'm not no, no. That's not that's not the game I want. It's not a game. Some people may want to play this game, but I'm not gonna play it. <clears throat> it's the same game from that from last time, from Asphalt 8. Probably better graphics. You can't tell because the compression on this video sucks. Look at the blur. So much blurring on the ground textures. Can't see anything, dude. They call it 1080p. What is it? 1080p, 2 Mbps, just like a stream. <laughs> yeah, Despicable Me. Pero Despicable, yeah, Despicable Me. They never promised uh, a pay to pay to uh, pay once and then play and uh, play for the entire game. But yeah, Despicable Me. I don't like that game in, in any way. But it's a it's a endless runner. It's understandable. There's a lot of game love games so talaga, but it's just uh my yung promise talaga nila that Asphalt 8 no microtransactions not free to play or you just buy it once. And then Modern Combat 5 uh uh no microtransactions you pay once. They 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 literally went back on their word for both of those games. In both of those games I paid for and I thought it would be you know one time payment. And gonna be, uh, no. I know, I know most of most of mga consumers dito would be like, ah, yes, I like free to play. I don't like free to play. It's stupid. All the all the boosts and shit. I want a full game. In Modern Combat 5, the single player campaign was terrible. It was super, super horrible. It was like five missions. And that, well, it's, it's more than that, but the story was completely useless and incoherent. And then. They just ended. It, the story just ended completely stupidly. No, walang point, walang walang kalag, walang kalatoy latoy yung ending. I'm like, what the heck? What is this? A version? I know half half the game is this. I did I just buy half the game? Is the story just half? One third? This, the 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 length of the campaign of Modern Combat Five is almost one third the campaign of Modern Combat Four in terms of length and variety. It's literally like 10 missions. Sometimes you repeat missions to gain more levels and crap before you get to the next mission. What is that? Come ah, Stupid. Yeah, so Asphalt 9 is available now, at least in, in some sort of open beta in, uh, in iOS. Um, you know what? Let's watch, let's watch some videos. Not all videos, though. Uh, Asphalt 9. I'm, not, I'm definitely not going to play it. Of, one thing's for sure I don't play a lot of uh, a lot of um, what is called uh, mobile games anymore anyway so it's not gonna make a difference for me <clears throat> a very nice environment at least this is in Egypt I think <laughs> Excuse me. The incoming traffic. Oh, that's nice. I mean, may on wait, may oncoming traffic no pala before I remember. Ah, oh, he wrecked. <coughs> Seems like a better looking. Seems like a better looking asphalt aid. What what I don't binago nila in terms of gameplay though. Eh. Whatever. <clears throat> Alright, so Hello. <clears throat> I hate that I have to clear my throat all the goddamn time. I don't I don't understand. I need a I need a, anybody a doctor? Come on, run. I 
I have this condition right now that I keep one. My there's a lot of phlegm in my throat all the time now. I don't know. I <clears throat> maybe I need like three tubs of vitamin C. <clears throat> okay. Um. So what do you want to uh, discuss first here? Android P. So Android P has just been announced. It's uh, what is it called? The developer, the developer preview is out this week. And um, <coughs> let's see, blog post. Oh, wait, um, Google blog post. Wait, so you know, blog. Meron ba silang blog post? Yo, and here we go. Three days ago. Right, right. Okay. <coughs> Oh, inter positioning with Wi-Fi RTT. Okay, round trip time. So that's a that's a very interesting feature. Um, inter positioning ngayon with Wi-Fi. That's interesting. <clears throat> that's very interesting. Uh, display cutout support. Oh, here we go. Here we go. The notch. Okay. Now apps can take full advantage of the latest device screens with full screen content. We've added display mm. cutout into the platform, along with APIs that you can use to manage how your content is displayed. Cutout support works seamlessly for apps with the system managing status bar height to separate your content from the cutout. If you have critical, immersive content, you can also use new APIs to check the cutout shape and request full screen layout around it. You can check whether the current device has a cutout by calling get display <laughs> cutout and then determine the location and shape of the cutout area using display cutout. The new That's window so layout attribute layout in display cutout mode lets you tell the system how and when layout your content relative to the cutout area. Details are here. To make it easier to build and test cutout support in your app, we've added a developer option that simulates a cutout, a cutout on, out any, on device. any device. We recommend testing your existing apps with display cutout enabled to ensure that your content displays <laughs> properly. <laughs> That's so funny. So they, they in in Android P, what's up, Koya Norms? In Android P, uh, they actually put in uh, application protocol interface API. I think That's what I don't know. <coughs> Lumabas sa akin yung chat replay. What do you mean chat replay? Um, and then it actually tells you, it actually lets you ping the the the, the manufacturer of the well, well. It you you can actually command Google to check kung ha, if the if the phone has a cutout, and you can make make apps based on that cutout. Very interesting. <coughs> Improve messaging notifications. It highlights who is messaging and how you can reply. You can show conversations, attach photos. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, okay, okay. That's not bad. That's pretty good. Small updates. Multi-camera API. Oh, you can now access streams simultaneously from two or one. Okay. <clears throat> Seamless zoom, bokeh, stereo vision. HDR VP9 video. Oh, you can now deliver HDR enabled movies to your users. To your users from YouTube, play movies and other sources of HDR capable devices. That's very nice. <clears throat> Uh, ba 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 ba. ART performance, blah blah blah. Okay, first make sh your app com. Wait, I know back. What are we talking about here? Okay, interesting, very interesting. So here's Android P uh, from Ars Technica, and uh, I, I'm I'm sure most most of this is very small changes. So totoo lang. But some of them are very, very interesting. So new notification panel looks like this now. Um, there instead of this, I actually like this over this. But okay, maybe they're going for something different now. 
<coughs> Other little changes. Oh, the volume is on the right side now. Interesting. Huh. Okay. Alright, ano ba? New settings. Okay. So now it's slightly different. Oh, para na siyang ano? Para siyang Samsung. <laughs> Parang ano, yung colored. Wait, pati yung ano, ano, nasan ba yung phone ko? Sa Oreo. Ah, uh, yeah, black and white pa rin yung sa, ano. Yeah, gray and white pa rin yung sa Oreo. Interesting. Colored na siya, parang Samsung. Lol. <coughs> Final release in quarter three. Okay. Hmm. Okay. So, not a lot of new things on Android P, but there's some... Uh, I like yung HDR content. Uh, otherwise, I think it's pretty much just upgrades all around. I don't think it's as important as Nougat or Oreo or something like that. It shows that there was problem fix. Please fix these. What? What problem? Yeah, now they're checking out the new stream. Then. No, uh, stream works fine. <clears throat> Let's see. Um, what about stats? Stats, not then. Stream health. Yep, stream health is good. Okay, let's move on to. Close on natin yan. Maganda ba tong Huawei too light? Let's let's check this out. Oh, Sims Mobile. Let's look this. Okay. Wait, meron na ba? Oh, Google Play. Wait, ayaw ko mag-open ng Google Play na may pangalan ko. <clears throat> Play at google.com I don't like the Android P design changes for iOS. I guess. Uh, seems mobile. Libre. <laughs> the Sims Mobile Electronic Arts Simulacion. Wait, the game is in English language? Hindi naman siguro. Meron naman siguro yan. Looks promising, the Sims Mobile. That's a new video. No, wala. What? That's a new video. Refresh natin. Ayun. Let's watch this. <coughs> Wow! That's very detailed. Hindi ba magchachag yung mga telepono dito? Is this multiplayer? Wait, is it multiplayer? Yeah, then. Um, March 1. <laughs> Ang gira basay ng Tagalog. Eh. Supercell is greater than Game Love. What's up, Kuya Antonio Arenas? <coughs> hmm. Mano tayo YouTube nito. Uh, Sims Mobile. Let's see, what's going What is up, everyone? Mr. Rape. We're going to play a little prank on them. That sounds like fun, right? I'm super excited. But as you can see, here is the heirloom. Oh my god. <laughs> And Tommy button thing on your dummy, holy crap. Doesn't seem awkward, and that's not awkward at all. Can I join Zachary? Oh, do I have to quit my other free world? Um, I've never been a big Sims player. I'm just trying to like live this. 
I was more of a SimCity player until, you know, nung, nung medyo na-satisfy na ako sa syudad ko, nag, ayoko na. Hindi na ako naglalaro. But I will play Tropico if I... If that's, that's, that's my... I like Tropico. <clears throat> ano ba nangyayari sa ating ano? Puro nung... Ting! Okay. Uh-uh. So that's uh, Android. Wait, not Android. That's that's the Sims Mobile. Um, it's available in the Google Play Store. Yun lang eh. Wala masyadong information. I mean, we could read a lot of the information online, and I'm I'm sure it's it's a, a decent representation of the Sims, for the most part. And it's a free game, so it's not a bad thought to play Sims online if you're a big. If you're a big Sims fan, um, I just wonder kung ano yung ano niya, ano yung mga requirements niya. Let's see. Okay, ito may website sila. Create unique sims. Build the perfect home. Shape your sims lifestyle. Play together. Uh, what, what kind of phone do I need? Kailangan talaga maano eh, no? Kailangan talaga tayo pa magta-testing kung anong kailangan na phone. Kuya Alex, medyo off topic. I'm buying uh, a phone that is the best of the best for photography. Yeah, S9 is a good choice. Uh, LGV 30 pixel too. I think S9. Um, for 19, yung ano niya? IM, uh, IMDB tole. <laughs> yung um, S9's uh, DXO mark is 99. That's the highest ever. <coughs> Very similar to Sims. Well, anyway, that's the Sims Mobile. It's free to play. You can download it if you want. Um, what do you want to discuss? Okay, Chica shitting, <laughs> shitting down. <laughs> May sale si Nokia, by the way. Uh, let's see. Let's read that. I'm pretty sure I have it on email. Um, so, nagbaba lahat ng prices ng Nokia, as you would expect. Kasi nag-sale sila before, right? So, bumaba lahat ng prices nila. I think na-discuss natin to last week. Um, let's see, Nokia. But it was made more official this week. Nokia March promo. There it is. So, let me just click on this. Yeah, here we go. Okay. Nokia March promo. Um, get two Nokia 2 for only 10,000. What is this? Nokia 2? Wait, 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 wait. What is this? What is this? Wait, 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 wait. Let's go Zenfone 4 Max. What am I doing? What is this? Oh no! Oh no! What? <laughs> what happened, Nokia? What did you do? Nokia, what did you do? <laughs> Can you see this? Oh no! So Java, to? They cut. They. They. Let's let's give them the benefit of the doubt. They have. The same. They have the same um, layout or phone phone pr- positioning as the Zenfone uh, heart thing that they were trying to go for. Sajabato or hindi sajab? Ano ba to? 
Ano reaction ni ano? Ano reaction ni ni no, ni, ni Zenfone dito? Ni Asus dito? I wonder. Ano nangyari? This is the first I've seen this. Ha! Huh. That's so funny. Alright. Let's close that. Uh, meron silang mga promo eh. Eh, ito, ito, ito. Here are the lower prices for for the Nokia series, right? The Nokia 3 6490 from 6990. The Nokia 6 is now 10990 from 11990. Nokia 8 is now 24990 from 29990 and Nokia 5 is 8990 from 9990 and uh, you get a JBL speaker for every purchase of the Nokia 3 <coughs> and then JBL Bluetooth headset with every purchase of the Nokia 8 I think that's fine kaya lang yung JBL headset na yan siguro 1000 lang yan totoo lang still that's not bad you know it's a free it's a free Bluetooth headset it's not I'm not gonna complain if you said if you walked up to me on the street and said, "Yo, me bago on Bluetooth headset, boy," and then I'm like, "Yeah, thank you, boy." All right, so twenty four nine ninety na lang si si Nokia eight, and uh, you get a free um, what is it? You get the free uh, Bluetooth headset, which is not the, I'm not gonna complain. Now chica shitting down. <laughs> um. May website pa ba si Chica? Tingnan na natin, Chica. Okay. Ito pala, may website pa sila eh. <coughs> Natatandan ko pa tong Chica na to eh, putang ina. Ang daming... Ang daming mga, naka, mga walang load na putang ina eh, mga squatter na ewan. Uh, magkano po ba yung ano? Magkano po ba yung... Bibili, na, bibili sa OLX Tapos te-text ka sa Chica Sabihin wala siyang load Ano ba po? Sobrang ano? Sobrang nakaka-a na, Ewan ko Sorry, sorry na I'm, I'm sure may mga gumagamit ng Chica Somewhere out there May mga gumagamit ng Chica and some, uh, For legitimate reasons and, and emergency reasons But here is Chica And uh, matagal na to si Chica is For a while uh, 20 years na ata sila According to this Yeah, year 2000. Yeah, early 2000. Okay. Um, so, <laughs> can anyone recommend me a similar site like Chica? Di kasi ako bumibili ng load. Sending free? Like, seriously? Meron talagang tao. Oh well. <clears throat> so Chica was a service that would allow you to text for free, but when people reply to reply to that Chica text, yung nagbere reply sa Chica would spend a lot more money. And it was it was kind of uh, it's kind of a little bit irresponsible for people to be trying to send texts. For free, asking for free crap, niba. It it's it preys on the inherent kakuriputan to the max ng Pilipino. Kakuriputan to the max, and ang Pilipino sa totoo lang hindi talaga. Eto yung eto yung malisa Pilipino eh. Hindi sa walang pera yung Pilipino. May, may pera yung Pilipino. They just spend it on the wrong fucking things. Like 20 megapixel selfies. That's what they do. So yan. Nag-GG tuloy sila. Kasi may pambili sila ng iPhone. Pero wala silang pambili ng load. Ah, God. What how do how do um how do radio personalities keep their keep their voice up or your yung phlegm na hindi nag doesn't go up there uh, there um hindi nag hindi nag hindi nag collect sa throat mo para ma, ma <coughs> maigi na lang di ako gumagamit niyan. <laughs> Hindi, 
pero yun naman kasi yo uh, chica technically may 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 emergency purposes yung chica um, it allows you to text with their app without a phone for example it allows you it allows you to text for emergencies kung wala ka talagang load or wala ka talagang telepono or low bat ka or something like that so may actual purposes itong chica beyond just being such a really really annoying bitch na hindi makabili ng sariling load but 99.99% of the time that chica is used it's because you're an annoying bitch that hindi makabili ng sarili niyang load that is unfortunately the case and i think in t- in today's modern world bumaba nang bumaba yung buti na lang in today's modern world like ngayong smartphone era and what not Kumonti na nang kumonti, kahit papano, yung fucking annoying bitch that couldn't buy their own goddamn load, right? At least kahit papano ngayon, meron ng mga old text, mga unli text, mga ganon. Hindi na, hindi na, wala na nung mga sobrang, ano, <laughs> meron pa rin mga scam do. Meron pa rin mga, uh, <coughs> you just, uh, no, you just got charged 300 pesos, text 300, ano yun? space 9 some, some, some something to xy xy to cancel ano to cancel discharge meron pa rin ganun may mga scammer pa rin ng load pero for the most part most people still have load na yung mga scammer na yun nagbibili ng unli text yung mga yun eh di ba hindi naman hindi naman libre yun eh so that's what they do now um, so at least ngayon may load na kahit yung scammer may load na um, so nawala yung purpose nitong chika Nawala yung purpose ng, ng, ng chika. So, for the, for the most part, ngayong early 2010s, uh, up to the 2018s, uh, nawala nang nawala yung purpose for, for downloading chika. And one thing that is a problem with chika, originally naman talaga, since, since it was announced, was the, the really, really, really annoying parang reply text na parang, um, to text ka ng chika na parang, ah, oh, free, you know, something, something, this was sent by chika, something, something. It's just an annoying little piece of crap text that you get na parang nakakaasar pa siyang basahin. Kasi alam mong squatting yung kausap mo eh. Pag squatting, pag mga sobrang chipipay na walang maka, hindi makaload na bitch, wala na talaga. Akausapin mo pa ba yung tao na yun? It's just, it represents the shittiest of the shit people that you're talking to, basically. That they can't afford. It's like, nagbebenta ka sa OLX and then text ka ng Giga. Sir, available. Uh, 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 pwede bang, pwede bang two pesos lang itong, ano mo, wala na. So, uh, please reply, please. Wala na akong load, please. Reply, please. So, it, 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 it represents the scum of the earth dito sa Pilipinas when they're using Chica most of the time. So, I think that's an, um, people frown upon using it, and uh, eventually, because it's being frowned upon, because some people have load now and buying yung mga only text and whatnot. Na wala siya, na, 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 na it it became less and less important or uh, or less and less usable as an app and less ano uh, less whatever. Anyway, nasa yung A seventy one natin. Ah, nasa Facebook pala yun. Hindi talaga. <laughs> I need something to get fixed with the my uh, my bro- bronchial tubes or I don't know. Whenever I have this show, since uh, since na ako and all that. All right, Oppo A seventy one. Let's let's talk about this one because I don't know anything about it right now. Uh oh, 2018 for the A seventy one. Oh nga pala. Kasama ko pa si B-Boy nito eh, yung A seventy one na 2017 eh. <clears throat> the video. All right, let's talk about Oppo A71. Here it is. Speedy operation. Three gigabytes of RAM, eight core A71. This is the. Is this the new one? Wah naman luma. Okay, this is the new one. I think. Sleek unibody. Wait, 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 wait. Bakal luma pa to. Specs. MT6750. Ito ba yung bago? Ito yung luma. Let's see. 2018. No Snapdragon 450 yung bago. Fake news! 
<coughs> si Pinoy Techno Guide. Sign natin. Okay. Pinoy Techno Guide says 5.2 inch 1080p uh, display, 1.8. Uh, ano yung process of that? New Gat Snapdragon 450. Yes! Thank you, Oppo! Thank you, Oppo! <laughs> 13 megapixel rear, 5 megapixel front, 16 gigs of uh, storage, and then makani RAM niya? 2 gigs of RAM. Now, this is what I'm talking about, dude! Plastic with metallic finish, 7990. Kamusta ang, con ang condition mo? Condition ko sa what? Sa sipon? Because that's still going on, apparently. So, uh, OPPO A71 was announced in February 2018 And it's gonna be released soon, I think Or is it available now? Uh, with advanced, gives you the jewelry among your favorites OPPO, Available now at 7990 And it's Snapdragon 450 Thank God! Ah, uh, there's a website si OPPO Okay Here it is AI Beauty Recognition Technology <coughs> Exquisite front camera. Oh, 1.4 micron pixels. That's pretty good. 13 megapixel rear camera. Yeah, ma masama pa rin yung ano ko eh. Pero normally, pag, pag hindi ako nag... Kasi eh, sa BTS is the most amount of time that I, you know, keep talking and talking and talking. Kasi, well, ako lang naman nandito. Um, and I don't, I don't get a lot of time to clear my throat and breathe. Um... And I think that that makes yung sipon even worse, whatever. But um, I think for the for the most part, ano din ito kailangan ko rin ng kailangan ko rin ng maybe clearing the clearing my throat and clearing my nose somehow, either through maybe soul milk or something like that. I I think this is a, a throat related problem that siguro dahil inuubo ako nung few weeks ago. Hindi parin hindi ko parin na iubo yung 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 phlegm for ano eh nawala lang yung ubo nawala lang yung kate pero hindi ko pa na yung ubo normally kasi sa ubo you have to cough out the phlegm right so nandun pa yung phlegm I think that's what's causing it sobrang pussy <laughs> sobrang weak ako sa ano eh sa pag ubo pag ubo gusto ko just matutulog lang ako tulog lang ako ubo 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 and then hindi I don't actually take the proper medication when I'm coughing so yun ang problem ko so, that's my problem I just usually want to just survive it and uh, not not Sometimes I'm not completely healed by the time the 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 sick the, the yeah the, the 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 sickness the virus is gone so unfortunately you know my body is still reacting to it so yun you may sipon pa rin ako and may phlegm pa rin sa sa lalamunan ko which makes it harder to talk for long periods of time anyway <clears throat> incredible smooth performance latest Qual Qualcomm Snapdragon 450 nice. Uh, lower power consumption. Oh, it's 14 nanometer. Yes. Oh, this is good. Holy moly. Okay, you need body. 5.2 inch HD, 3000 milliampere battery, color OS. Series of specs. Uh, Android 7.1 a color OS. Snapdragon 450, 2 gigs of RAM, 16 storage. Uh, let's see. Wi-Fi, obviously 5.2 inch HD, 13 megapixel camera. Ito yung malaking bagay dyan, yung Snapdragon 450 Oh, it's a TFT screen, it's not a IPS or anything Medyo bu bummer, pero it, it could be that, okay Dual nano SIM cards I like this, I like this, this is promising 14 nanometer is good It's gonna be a very, this, this is gonna be one of those Phones that have good battery life, honestly, because if it's 14 nanometer process, this is promising. I like this for 8,000. Not bad, not bad. I mean, obviously, kung nagbibilang ka lang, if you're just comparing like for like, you could buy uh, uh, a Xiaomi, obviously, for with the Snapdragon 625 and a full HD display, much better specs than this, but. Uh, kung tatanggalin mo lang si Xiaomi Obviously Xiaomi is the outlier here Sila yung 
completely destroying the the entire world right now, at least sa Pilipinas. In terms of uh, price to performance. Um, kung tatagal mo sa Xiaomi, very competitive si Oppo A81. And, and sometimes, we just have to remove Xiaomi from the equation. If we wanna actually discern the the wh- how competitive the phone is kasi napaka napaka layo ni Xiaomi sa competition nila that is so hard to to weigh the positives and negatives of phones like the Oppo A71 2018 against the Xiaomi phone but against 90% of all of the manufacturers in the Philippines the Oppo A71 is very competitive <laughs> Wag na nating isa sa Puera Xiaomi, Puera Xiaomi, yun na lang, talagang Puera Xiaomi. So there it is, Oppo A71, very interesting phone. I like this. This is a very good upgrade over the shitty MediaTek processors that we've been. 6750. Wow. I mean seriously, this is a great great upgrade. That's nice. I like this. Um it's no longer a MediaTek processor. Thank God. So there it is, the Oppo A71 2018, available now for $7,990. Tignan nga natin, meron ba sa Lazada? Wait, open tayo igog nito. Na uh, Lazada. Eh no, Redmi 5A, oh. Coming soon. Wait, oh, bago to, ah. Snapdragon 425 entry level smartphone king Nani What's this Me video supports popular video formats and subtitles Huh interesting <coughs> Nani okay ngate Redmi 5A Pero I think ano ba tong 425? 425. What is the the sublimation process? Nanometer. 28 nanometer pa to. I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like this. This is 25 nanometer. 28 nanometer. And we all do, we'll add, we'll add in some price, so I guess it's not that important. Alright, let's go back to Oppo A71. Ay, baka luma itong malumitaw na Oppo A71, ano? Um, yan natin. Oh, ito bago na, Oppo A71 2018. Ito luma pa to. Yeah. Okay, this is the old one. This is a new one, 2018. Kasi naman, why did they name it the same number? Dude. Oppo, come on, man. <clears throat> Alright, so it's available now. I don't know officially to CEC, CEC online. But it's available now for $7,990. So Lazada even. So that's the Oppo A71. Promising, but... Promising only if you talk about the phone where... Xiaomi phones, okay? So that's there it is. And it only if you if you're interested in features ng um tag dito. Features ni Oppo of course, like selfie 3D selfie or whatever it's called. Um oh man, I'm gonna send no notifications. So last topic. Para matapos tayo agad. <laughs> Wala masyado eh. I mean what what else do you want to discuss? Oppo and Huawei Nova 2 Lite. Um, this has been teased for a while now. Hindi tayo kasama sa mga Huawei events, so okay. Um, officially revealed the Huawei 2 Lite in the Philippines. Uh, can be considered a toned down variant of the Huawei 2i, Nova 2i. Snapdragon instead of Kirin, lower camera resolution, single front camera, smaller RAM storage, and battery capacity. Okay lang. Snapdragon 430. Wait, yun ba yung ano? Yung, ano na ba tong 430? Hindi, ano to eh. Um, 
This is still a 28 nanometer. Yeah, this is still 28 nanometer. Boring! <coughs> face unlock. God fucking. Goddamn face unlock. EMUI 8, 3000 mAh battery, Android 8 Oreo. Okay, that's good. Android 8 Oreo. So here it is. Huawei, Huawei Nova 2 Lite is a 1440x720p display, 18x9. Snapdragon 430, 3 gigs of RAM, 32 gigs of storage, 3 plus 2 megapixel camera sa likod, and 8 megapixel front, dual SIM, LTE, obviously, blah 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 blah. Wala pong presyo. Blech. Okay. Ngayon natin? Wala pa? Uh, price. Fake news. <coughs> wala, si, wala pa atong price. What's the price? Well, I don't want to get a Well, I don't think there's a price for it yet. Oh, uh, I don't know. I don't, this might be this the the specs for the Nova 2 Lite is. Wait, that's a new pre-order. Give me information on pre-order. Pre-order soon. <clears throat> March 14. Customers who pre-order will get a free pair of JBL E40 BT Bluetooth headphones. Yeah, how much is that? Two thousand libo, siguro SRP, pero malamang isang libo lang to. Wow, naman, sobrang mal naman yun. Di ano ni Wala John? So that's what? Three thousand? No, that's like three five. 3,500. Okay, so mga 2,000 to mga ganun. 1,500 uh, one siguro mga actual, you know, cost cost of the product. Hindi naman, hindi. <laughs> lahat, yung 3,500 na yun, that's a lot, that's a lot of, uh... Richard Lanuza says, 9,990 po official. Uh, Oppo F7 ang susunod sa Asus na may notch. Huh? Ano Oppo F7 ang susunod sa Asus na may Ang susunod sa Oppo na may notch siguro. Ah, ang susunod sa Asus Zenfone 5, you mean. Well, uh, <coughs> Oppo F7. Plus, may tumataginting na 20. 25 megapixels! Oh, look at that. Uh, called the Oppo, it's a successor to Oppo F5. Oh, yeah. 6.2 inch screen, full HD plus resolution. <laughs> 25 megapixel front camera! Wow! Alright. So 9990? Oh, I don't know if I want to pay 9990 for these specs. I mean, it's not the worst thing in the world. But compare mo to dun sa ano yun? Oppo na A71. I guess in the I guess I guess single lens Oppo A71, that's maybe why. This is a Snapdragon 450. Look at this. Snapdragon 450. 7990 versus Snapdragon 430 720p. Pareho din 720p. It's just that this is 1440 in the 1280x720. So this is 18 by 9 This is uh, 7, uh, 16 by 9 Right? This has two rear cameras. This has one rear camera. Uh, one front camera that's 8 megapixels. One, one front camera that is 5 megapixels. And then how much RAM? 3 gigs? 3 gigs RAM, 2 gigs RAM. 
<coughs> and and whatnot and whatnot. So this has slightly lower processor, slightly more RAM, more cameras. If that even makes any difference, and that's about it. So for 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 what two thousand pesos more, that's what you get. Um, I mean, I'm not complaining. It's not a bad, but it's still 10,000 pesos. This is 10,000 pesos. And when you're paying 10,000 pesos, you should rather... Just get the Mi A1. Kung ganito na lang din binabayad mo, you're getting really shitty processors too. Uh, yeah. This, pagdating sa pagsampa ng 10,000 pesos, medyo... Medyo pumapangit yung price point ni Huawei 2 Lite. Uh, Nova 2 Lite because of the the Mi A1. Um, I'm not saying the A71 is in the clear because syempre malaki, malaking competition pa rin siya with the Xiaomi Redmi Note 4 Pro? Redmi Note 4 something. I forgot. Anyway, alam nyo na naman yung, you know what I'm talking about. Um, but those are, those are, those are our two, two stuff, stuff, this, this, um, when it comes to phones. So, tapos na tayo dun. Ay, teka lang, ha? We should talk about Nintendo a little bit if you want. Uh, if you're, if any of you are interested, um, there's some very good announcements. I'm not very much interested. I mean, I'm sure a lot of people would be interested in um, Nintendo. What you need to know, na lang. <laughs> uh, okay, ito investor place. Okay. What? What the fuck is this? What? Are, okay. Nasdaq. Uh. Okay. Okay. Five biggest announcements of Nintendo Direct. Okay. Super Smash Brothers for Switch is coming this year. This is. I actually was. A, a, this is a trailer. It was super exciting. What what happened with when they announced the Smash Brothers? I'm not a big Smash Brothers kind of player. Um, I never understood this, the the combat system of Smash Brothers. But the, even I was very um, excited. Um, so let's let's actually watch a little bit of the of the direct. Hopefully, hindi tayo ma-copyright ni Nintendo, right? Nandito pa lang, I think, we're already getting copyrighted. But let's watch the... The... The infamous... The reveal. Okay. Oh, what's going on? Dun, dun, dun! Dong. This is so cool. This came out so cool. Yeah, Mario, check him out. Zelda, fucking hell. <laughs> that was exciting. That was you know watching that trailer was exciting. Even though I'm not a Smash Brothers player, that was exciting. Um, it's super huge news for a lot of people. That's of course, it's a lot of Smash Brothers players out there, and it's coming out on Switch, and that was almost like a system seller right there. It's literally a system that people will buy a Nintendo Switch for this, even if they haven't bought. Even if yung parang some of those most stalwart people that don't, haven't bought a Switch yet, mapipilitan silang bumili ng Switch for this game. This is gonna be huge. From what I can tell, because Smash Brothers is a huge game. Anyway, uh, other than that, um, Dark Souls. Some people, Warrior. Where? No, well, I did too. I wanted the the Toad. There's a game. Oh yeah, um, what Mario Tennis? Um, and happy not new Prince 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 Toad game. Oh, this one I like this. This looks really cool. This Toad game. To 
Captain Toad Treasure Tracker is bound for Nintendo's... I know it looks kiddy, but it looks really cool to play. ...sandbox style levels inspired by a Japanese box garden called Hakoniwa. You can rotate the camera and touch the screen for a better view of hidden treasures. I like Toad, it's, it's, uh, it's such and a... this time, we've included a few... Super it's such Mario a cool Odyssey looking character too. now. Now you can explore locales from a variety of... Yeah, look at him! Haha! <laughs> ...New Dog City. Ang laki ng character niya, he's like... Hindi siya si Par and it's not like Mario that moves so fast. It's a slow moving character. It's such a cool concept. I like it. A few Super Mario Look at him! <laughs> Wala lang. I think this this game is gonna be cool. I like this. This is probably the one I will buy. Um, Captain Toad Treasure Tracker. Um, I'm not sure, sure what kind of game it is, but. I, I'm liking the design already. Obviously, there are other games like the Kirby one that's coming very soon. Um, that's what they own. Kirby. <clears throat> Okami is coming to the... Okami HD is also coming to uh, Nintendo Switch. Which means I will buy Okami HD for Nintendo Switch. And Gooey. Yeah, bro. <laughs> Look it's at that. It's like a game. dream come true to bring this ragtag crew of characters together. From I'm not a big Kirby fan. I might not play this, but I like the Prince Prince Toadstool or whatever its name is. Uh, that game, I'll buy that. But you know, look at all these games. These are pretty interesting games. Uh, I think the biggest uh, announcement is, of course, the Smash Brothers. That's that's the number one thing everybody's talking about. The Smash Brothers announcement. Sa dami ng Nintendo footage na nilag nilabas natin, I'm sure copyrighted na tong video na to. <laughs> Yung ating BTS ngayon. Oh well. Yeah. What up, bits? Mario. <laughs> Alright, that's cool. That's cool, I like that. And uh, that's pretty much it. No, a lot of time we other topics for this week. Obviously, we talked about the Nova 2 Lite and the A71. I like the A71. That's very promising for um, for Oppo to do. That's like the most the most forward-thinking act act that um, that uh, Oppo has done in recent years. So thank God. They're they're actually thinking about actually improving um, their products. Anyway, I think that's about it. Well, time to topics. Unless we're maybe uh, seeing We 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 even checked out the Oppo F7 and whatnot. So there you go. I'm gonna I'm gonna eat dinner because I haven't eaten dinner yet. Um, so like I said, kanina, sinundo namin yung mother ko from her. Uh, uh, she went on a cruise. She went on the uh, Superstar Virgo cruise that went to uh, Naha, Japan, and then to Taiwan, and then back to the Philippines. Unfortunately, she didn't enjoy it very much. Sabi niya sobrang maalo nung, nung dagat. It's, it's not a very relaxing cruise. Um, but yeah, that's about it. Sinundo namin yung mother ko. That's why nakatulog ako after. Um, hindi ako masyado nakatulog because of puyat ako para sunduin yung mother ko. Alright, guys. Thank you very much for watching. That's it for our show. Big time show on um, what time? March 10th, 2018. Uh, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Uh, uh, <clears throat> uh, <laughs> what? What the? Oh wow! If I move my phone this way, or or nag nag yung orientation na mama tayong music niya. <clears throat> okay. All right, guys, that's about it for the show. Thank you very much for watching, and see you guys next time. Bye. -bye. Thank you, Koya Norms, for the get well. <laughs>